What's up, YouTube? We're MLW, and we're at the Twinsburg World Series. Let's go! All right, Tom. 2019 Twinsburg World Series of Wiffle. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. You know, we've been out here, I think this is our fifth season out here, so I'm very comfortable in this environment, in this atmosphere. A lot of fans out here. I gotta say, the city of Twinsburg shows the most love I've ever, ever been. Yep. And, uh, you know, we got Dan here teaching the youth how to play the game. That's key. Gotta start him young, you know. So it's just, it's a good day. It's a good day. Uh, as you can see, we got a big crowd of people over here. Uh, we got a bunch of kids anxious to hit in the home run derby here. So uh, we're gonna try and catch them on their way to get them in line and uh, see what they're thinking as they're heading into this intense derby. No ticket, no swings. Strict. I love it. Hey, my prodigy in the bandana right there. I love to see that. <laughs> How confident are you you're going to hit some home runs? Not very confident. Not confident? Did you hit any dingers yet today? No. No dingers. Hey, no you're gonna, this is your time. AJ here. AJ, the full Wiffle character here. He's got his crushed spray can, the hat, the shades. He bought a nice custom bat here for himself. AJ, I got high expectations of you, my guy. Uh, how many dingers are you going to hit? Ten. Ten. Ten bombs from this kid. All right, if you hit ten, I swear, I will get on the ground and do 50 push-ups for you. 10, 10 home runs, okay? Right. I'm gonna chirp, I'm gonna chirp from behind. Uh-oh! Foul. Wow. No good. Nope. It's wind, hey, I do feel for the kid. It's a little windy. I can tell you right now, I'm not doing any push-ups. There's no way this kid's hitting 10. Well, let's be nice. Yeah. Let's be nice. We don't have to go there. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong, but you didn't have to say it. I mean, good lord. <laughs> You hear that? You're not hitting 10. <laughs> Too confident. You can't get cocky before you hit any. Hey, uh, I like your shirt, dog. Thanks. Actually, throwback. Last year, one year ago, you said that Zach Pirac was the worst player. I need the update. Who is the new worst player in MLW? New worst player. That's hard. Um, That's hard. It's a tough decision. Oh. Come on, you gotta have an answer. I think in I'm sticking with the same. Oh! <laughs> he did oh. him dirty two yeah, years in a row. Oh, Needs to pick up the average. Hey, Dan, what exactly have you been doing all day? A whole lot of nothing. Usual Daniel antics, a whole lot of nothing. We dragged this guy out of bed this morning at like 6 30. He looked like a zombie. I was gonna. I thought there was a dead kid in the back seat of the car. He looked so tired. Pathetic.
Oh my god, damn. You didn't say it was Say that. Am I asking you or am I answering? Uh, asking me. I just not listening. Alright, make up a question. Hold on, make, make up a question. Yeah, Bill, oh my I god, the demotion. It's all <laughs> caught on camera, too. I know. <laughs> that Thank will you. wrap up day one for the MLW squad. We're 2 yes, and we're moving on to tomorrow. And uh, we're going to be in the semifinals. So, uh, okay. yeah, we're going to be looking to win it all. But Sounds good. How would you assess your pitching on the mound? Uh, assess my pitching. I mean, I only threw two, I think, like, Seven or eight batters, so not didn't face too many guys, but uh, overall it's pretty consistent. Uh, some decent movement. Um, Got to look at the drop a little bit better tomorrow. I threw the drop for a ball most of the time, but um, other than that, nothing to complain about. Uh, optimistic going into day two, looking for another championship. Day two semis coming tomorrow, but first, folks, we have a clinic we do have a going clinic. on for the kids. We're gonna have some contests for prizes. It's gonna be a fun event, so we'll cut to that right now. Yeah, bring it in. Bring it in. Tom's got something to say. Alright, let's get, get it. Line. Get a line, get a line. I am gonna be throwing my risers to these kids. We'll see if they can hang. Here we go. Next up, Dan Schultz. You guys think you're gonna hit Daniel? Yes. Dan's our Cy Young, so. Drop right here. Got him. Oh! Oh, he's, he's in disbelief right now. Show him the drop, man. The drop. He wants it. Bang. Oh, Lord! That was the best one. Instagram man, big fan. Aiden Carlson underscore 09. Hey, follow this man. Oh, Chad's getting in on it. Yay! Got a dog. What's the dog's name? Dog! dog. Wow. Basically, holes to the right, and you gotta get super low to maybe like right here, like above the ground. And the, t the trick is that when it comes off the fingers, you gotta make sure that the, s the holes are spinning like that so it, it rises up. And basically, a rule of thumb for all the wiffle balls is the ball is going to break opposite of the holes. So if the holes are facing right, it's going to be a slider left. If it's a riser, you know, holes facing down, it's going to rise up. Same with the drop. If you throw it, like, you know, like holes up, it's just going to drop down. So, you know, just get really low, like super low, like lower than you guys, like, think. That was nice. Really good. Hey, that was it. That was it. That was it. Same grip for righties, holes to the right. And then it's just over the top this time. I want to aim to the right. He's going to move to the left. We're going Tommy next. Hey, this this right here is the hardest pitch to hit in our league and the hardest to learn. Hardest to learn. How about ten strikes? Fifteen strikes. Y'all get pretty hard. Hey, if everyone. No. Fifteen in a row. Sure. Dead. <laughs> If you throw a ball, you're out. But if you throw a strike, you remain in and you go back to the back of the line. I'm here with my guy Sean. He just won the wiffle ball lighting. How do you feel, buddy? Well, I feel really good because at the end I got out and yeah. then I thought I was done for. Hey, you got the job done, man. And you have won some more free merch. He's already got the wiffle god. Yeah. Now you get the red classic tee. Out of boy. Oh yeah! All right, this is game two. Give him some space. Give him some space. Go, baby. Now game two of Wiffle Ball Lightning. We got my guy AJ. He's a big fan, and you just got yourself some free merch. How you feeling? Awesome. There we go. That will wrap up the clinic. Thanks guys for watching, and now we will go to day two of the Twinsburg World Series. Go
boy Connor. First of all, tell us about the Hawaiian theme going for the team today. What's the mindset behind that? We just thought this is <laughs> <laughs> the field is my paradise. Oh, so so this is getting personal. It's getting personal for you guys. Yeah. And then secondly, I was doing this with Grandma. <laughs> and secondly, why couldn't you bring down, bring home the championship to the hometown? Let twins bring down there. <laughs> Balls were scuffed. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's it folks. Championship game coming next. Championship game, here we go. All right, so that's going to do it for the Twinsburg World Series of Wiffle Ball. MLW brings home the title, our third one. I just can't thank Twinsburg enough for putting on a great event. And thank you to my guys, Tommy and Daniel, for all their efforts here this weekend. Tommy, speak to how well this event is run and our efforts this weekend. Oh, it's a great tournament. Um, all the kids out here showing a lot of love for the league. It's awesome to see. They're very enthusiastic. Yep. Going to be some great future Wiffle Ball players. And uh, thanks to Rich for putting on the event. All right. And that's going to do it for the video. If you want to subscribe to MLW, click in that corner. And if you want to see the last video, click in that corner. As always, merch and tourney science linked in the description. We'll see you next time. Plug. You got to plug it. Thank you.